some programming languages use statements of the form R unless S to mean that as long as S does not happen, then R will happen. More formally, if R and S are statements, R unless S means if not S, then R. In 37 through 39, rewrite the statements in if-then form. Payment will be made on 5th unless a new hearing is granted. Now, I'm just going to be blunt. I really don't like the word unless. As an English word, I really find it inconvenient to use the word unless because the if-then statement form is just universally applicable. And I don't know why, but this is just the one statement that really throws me off. But luckily, we have the definition given to us here. So in this case, we'll say payment will be made on 5th is my R. And then we have unless a new hearing is granted will be my S. So now we can see that this is the same thing as if not S, then R. So we have to write that English statement. So we would say if and then not S, which is a new hearing is not granted, then R, which is that payment will be made on 5th. Thanks, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.